Leonardo da Vinci designed helicopters, tanks, and submarines in the 1400s, 400 years before they were actually invented. Before we continue, would you mind liking this video and subscribing to our channel? Now, let's discover how one Renaissance genius predicted the future of technology. Leonardo da Vinci wasn't just a painter, he was history's greatest visionary inventor. His notebooks contain over 13,000 pages of detailed designs for machines that wouldn't exist for centuries. In 1485, Leonardo sketched the first helicopter design he called the aerial screw. It used a spinning blade to generate lift, the exact same principle modern helicopters use 450 years later. But here's the amazing part. Leonardo understood aerodynamics and flight mechanics that scientists wouldn't formally discover until the 1800s. He was centuries ahead of his time. Leonardo designed the first military tank in 1487, complete with rotating cannons and protective armor plating. His design looks remarkably similar to World War I tanks built 430 years later. He invented a diving suit and underwater breathing apparatus for exploring beneath the ocean surface. His submarine designs included emergency air supply systems that modern submarines still use. Leonardo sketched parachute designs with detailed calculations proving they would work. In 2000, modern engineers built his parachute exactly as drawn, and it worked perfectly after 500 years. Here's the tragic irony. Leonardo couldn't build most of his inventions because the technology didn't exist yet. He needed engines, lightweight materials, and manufacturing precision that wouldn't be available for centuries. He understood that heavier-than-air flight was possible, and designed wings based on bird anatomy. The Wright brothers would eventually succeed using similar principles Leonardo documented 400 years earlier. Leonardo invented the ball bearing, the machine gun, the robot, and even a mechanical calculator. Modern engineers are still discovering functional designs hidden in his notebooks. His most ambitious design was a mechanical knight, a humanoid robot that could sit, stand, wave and move its jaw. When engineers built it from his plans in 2002, it actually worked. Leonardo wrote all his notes in mirror writing, backwards from right to left. Historians debate whether this was for secrecy or because he was left-handed and found it easier. He performed illegal human dissections to understand anatomy, creating the most accurate anatomical drawings of his era. His medical illustrations remained the best available for over 300 years. The frustrating tragedy, Leonardo never published his inventions. His notebooks were scattered and hidden for centuries. If his work had been widely available, the Industrial Revolution might have happened 200 years earlier. Modern analysis shows that at least 30 of Leonardo's designs would have actually worked if built with period materials. He wasn't just imagining, he was engineering. Leonardo died in 1519 believing he had accomplished nothing important. He apologized on his deathbed for offending God and mankind by not working on his art enough. The ultimate irony, Leonardo is famous for painting the Mona Lisa, but his engineering notebooks prove he was possibly the greatest inventor who ever lived. That's your Renaissance genius knowledge bomb.